Hi, I'm Bill Hartman, President and CEO of Premier Biomedical Inc. We're a relatively new firm. We were established in mid-2010 and became publicly trading in mid-2012. Uh, in the next few minutes, uh, I'm going to try to convey to you some of the exciting things we have going on here at Premier Biomedical Incorporated and try to try to convey the, the great passion we feel for this, this work and, uh, and its potential. In summary, we specialize in developing new products and procedures to cure diseases, a number of diseases, and you can see them on our website. The bulk of our technology is contained in our new procedures uh, covered by our 18 pending patents. What's different about this versus conventional methods is that we eliminate the pathophysiologic basis of disease totally eliminate it as opposed to trying to block or inhibit it uh, or treat it after after the disease occurs as is conventional methods. Uh, in conventional methods you take a pill and oftentimes there's a, there are disastrous side effects and unwanted side effects sometimes more severe than the disease itself uh, or procedures that destroy the bad stuff along with the good stuff. Uh, we don't do that. We just eliminate the cause of the disease. Uh, for example, let's just consider cancer. Cancer is a uh, is dependent on uh, uh, a number of select uh, molecular compounds. For example, cytokines, uh, angiogenic proteins, uh, tumorogenesis proteins, um, uh, signaling proteins, etc. Collectively, they and others form the the life force of cancer. Uh, in laboratory tests that we've conducted to date. Uh, we've been able to eliminate these uh, select molecular compounds, some as small as one trillionth of a gram within 10 minutes. Typically, uh, that time frame would suit uh, a hospital or, or doctor's office visit uh, time frame sitting on a, uh, on a table. Uh, uh, when we've done that with cancer tissue in a test tube, uh, the, the cancer tissue has been observed to have died within 24 hours without any external medication or procedures added. And this is, this is really great news for us. Uh, we're in the process right now of duplicating these tests on mice and going to move to larger animals and then subsequently we plan to move to clinical or patient testing. And if we're successful, as, as anticipated, uh, this could revolutionize medicine, we believe. And, and it, it could revolutionize uh, cancer treatment worldwide.